What's up, welcome to a quick new Final Cut tutorial. Today I'm going to show you two ways of how to create a black and white effect inside of Final Cut Pro without the use of any plugins, so let's not waste any time and jump right in. So as an example clip I'm going to use this part from a music video I shot in Frankfurt, Germany. And let's start with the first way of creating a black and white effect. Pretty easy, go down to the effects tab, it's located right here. If it doesn't pop up for you just click on this little symbol and you have the effects tab and type in black and you will already see black and white. Now you can just drag and drop this one onto the footage and you can see we have a pretty simple and easy black and white effect. Here you can see the before and after and of course we can also change the color that we use for the black and white effect to change up the black and white effect itself. And of course we can also change the amount of how much of the black and white effect we want to show in the footage. So now for the second effect of how to create a black and white effect, delete the black and white effect, go up to the color inspector and go to the saturation tab. We have color, exposure, but we need the saturation. And now if we drag the saturation all the way down, we don't have saturation, which results in a black and white image. And if we're on the color board already, it of course makes it a little bit easier to edit the intensity of the black and white effect. So change it from the saturations tab to the exposure tab. If we, for example, think the sky up here is too dark, we can just go to the shadows, lift them up a little bit. Now the image seems a little bit washed out. So take the midtones down again. And there we have it. Those were two ways of creating a black and white effect inside of Final Cut Pro. I really hope you enjoyed it and you learned something new. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button and also consider subscribing right here for more videos just like this one. You can find the Final Cut playlist right here and the last Final Cut tutorial right here. And I will hopefully see you in the next video. Goodbye.